what's up guys Anbuf here welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel hope you guys are all doing really really well welcome to episode 11 of AR setups and you know after doing 10 episodes on this series I finally decided to make this setup not just about Nova launcher setups but Android customization in general which is why in today's video which is episode 11 we're actually checking out a setup that is right in front of your screen right now as you guys can see which is based not on Nova but on Niagara launcher another launcher that I've really really taken a liking to so with that said today I'm going to talk about how you guys can get this exact look using Niagara launcher everything will be linked in the description below with that said Said, let's not waste any time drop a like subscribe to the channel and without any further ado let's get started All right guys, so first things first, as you guys can see, this is the current setup. Now, obviously the first thing that we're going to be talking about is the wallpaper. So this is a brown tones wallpaper. It's basically a macro image of a leaf, which I found on unsplash.com. The exact link to the wallpaper will be linked in the description below. So you guys can go ahead and download it. Now, once you've downloaded it and set it up as your main wallpaper, the first thing that we'll do is obviously download Niagara Launcher. Now, once you download Niagara Launcher, it's not gonna look exactly like this. That there are a couple of changes that I have done so I'm just gonna talk to you guys about how to do that the first thing we'll talk about is the icons because this is not your stock Android icon pack now to change the icon pack in Niagara launcher all you have to do is click and hold on an empty space then go to Niagara settings after that go to look and then make sure you select the icon pack of your choice now I'm using the Android 12 icon pack which is one of my favorite Android icon packs right now borrows a lot of colors from Android 12 and the new Android version with these cool muted colors and it also looks really really good with this wallpaper so definitely check that out once your icons are set up what we'll focus on is removing uh, the stock clock widget and adding an external KWGT widget here now to do that once again all you have to do is click and hold on any empty space and then go to Niagara settings once you're in Niagara settings what you'll do is go to features and then check the Niagara calendar widget once you turn off the basic you know widgets that are there inside this launcher which is basically this widget what we can do is click and hold on any widget then hit on edit custom widget now once you click on edit custom widget you can add a new widget and I'm going to show you how to change it by simply clicking on replace custom widget it'll open up a list of applications that have widget support on your Android phone from here all you have to do is select KWGT import a widget from here and then basically select the KWGT pack now the pack that I am using is called Elega for KWGT I'm quickly going to show you the pack that I'm using just going to open up KWGT here once you have that open as you can see this is the widget that I'm using it's called Elega analog 2 it has this really nice analog clock obviously shows you the date and time and this is obviously Niagara's stock widget that you can find right out of the box when you install this free launcher now I did try out Niagara Pro they have a 7 day free trial however you don't really need Niagara Pro to basically have these features but I thought I'd give it a try regardless considering it was pretty cheap and I found out a few cool nifty features that are really really cool the first thing among them includes you know double tap on the text on your home screen to basically turn it off you can use this in case you want to there's also uh, you know music applications with embedded music players for example if I open up YouTube music and play a song as you can see that it starts playing over here and it's a fully functional widget which is really really cool I really really like it and I think it adds that little bit of extra customization you've also got all your applications on the right here simply uh, you know putting your finger on them will take out the alphabets and you can quickly swipe between them you can also add a feature in Niagara Pro which is basically swipe up to have a search bar for your applications and of course it also removes the status bar so you have to swipe down to get your status bar it's honestly really really cool I I think this is one of the new fresher AR setup videos that we have done and I would highly recommend you guys give Niagara a try especially if you're coming from Nova because even though I know Nova is like an old school favorite this is actually a really good launcher for maximum productivity as well as maximum customization definitely check it out drop your suggestions below which launcher we should check out for AR setups episode number 12 and with that said this is Anubhav signing out I hope you guys genuinely enjoyed it and yeah, I'll catch you guys next time. You guys have a great day. Until then, stay safe and uh, peace out.